So the, the, the Tynan Roberto match is big because, you know, back in the day they kind of had that little scuffle with, uh, you know, the showing the ass thing at the Las Vegas. And it was, uh, so it's kind of got a, a lot of buildup. Tynan has been on like a downhill, like sprint. He's been killing everybody. He's extremely, extremely tough. I think the favorite, um, Roberto's coming back. I don't, he, he's done a few matches, but hasn't really done too much since the couch. Uh, who's number one stuff. So I know he's hungry, done a, all his rehab stuff. He's going to you know, be back in, and obviously he's amazing. But i got to go with Tynan on this one. I think, like I said, he's sprinting downhill, and I don't think he's going to be stopping anytime soon. I mean. That is, is a match that everybody would like to see. Tainan is, is been have a, a, a wonderful really like, you know, year. Right. Roberto is awesome. He's doing great. He's... His no gi result has been great for the past couple of months. Now he's putting his gi back at again to the game. So I think it's it's and that in that particular match I believe it's gonna be pretty close, but I believe Roberto can surprise the Tainan with uh, with his skills and Tainan is also in the, is an awesome time, but I, I believe Roberto can take him. It is it, this is a match that definitely I wanna I wanna watch that, you know, and uh Jimenez is, is super aggressive. Uh, also he starts in a high pace, and Kaina too. Uh, sorry, Taina. <laughs> Taina too. Taina is a is a a guy that is winning everything, you know. And I remember, man, like people used to say, like, "Oh, this guy's a blue belt still, sandbagging, whatever," you know. But man, now he's a sandbag as a black belt, you know. <laughs> it's incredible what he's doing. It's incredible. Definitely, I gotta uh, congratulate Gilema and uh, uh, all the AOJ team for the amazing job that they're doing with, with Taina. And he's in a good pace, you know, and I believe uh, with the Gi, you know, I still like, I still think that Taina can, can, can do better. Uh, but Jimenez is Jimenez, you know, it depends like how he trains, how he feels. And when he's in a, in a beast mode, you know, I would say, ready to fight Jimenez is pretty much unstoppable, so. It's going to be a very interesting match. I love Roberto. I haven't seen him compete in the Gi in a while. I don't think I've ever seen him compete as a black belt yet. And Tynan is just Tynan. Like, Tynan's technique is flawless. I haven't seen him make any technical errors, any technical mistakes. So, he like said, right now, anybody against Tynan right now, you got to go with Tynan. Uh, Tynan and, his, and uh, Roberto. You know, I'm a big fan of Roberto game, but... Uh, I can see so much of the what the I can see so much the the thing that I like to teach in Tainan's game, you know. So the way he moves, the way he, you know, and of course, like I have been studying his game a lot for for good reasons. But uh, I like the way he moves, he anticipates, the way he controls. So he's a very good strategy, you know, outlet, and I think. I think I think he's the I think he's the name I think it's uh, between those guys I think he's very very concentrated Fox when you compare against uh, Robert I know Robert is very dangerous but uh you know but uh, it's, it's like I say like it's all probability but uh focus it's a uh, Taina is very is is an athlete that's very Fox he know how to do it since the fight starts so I don't I don't. I think that he, it's hard to, to take his, his fogs. I haven't been here competing, you know, like, and he has to be, he'll be unbeatable for a longer time.